All right, guys, we already took a shower. Look at this. This is uh, David Robarts retweeted this. I'm going to show you the schedule, the agenda for today. And I don't know if I'm going to post this. Oh, by the way, Josh Lewis grew through my haircut. What do you think, Grant? I think he did a pretty good job. So um, we just were on the mentor call last night, and I'm going to show you exactly what Mass of Action is, like I always do. I usually am not on my phone in the morning, and I usually um, don't post too much of social because I try and keep away from it, just so you know. Um, that's my whole YouTube studio with the setup there. I'm going to go through quick clips. Let me show you this. I just want to show you this part quick. Now this is a long clip here. Here it looks pretty. This is a Tim Tebow shirt. I reached out to him last night to get him on the Make More Money podcast. A very elite group of people coming on. Brian Cuban next week. Um, who else we got here? All right. So this is it. Wake up. Beat sun up. Card on you. Uh, workout. Goals breakfast. Card on role play. Uh, 50 calls, Alex Morton's months. All right, so we're gonna document all that. I'm gonna show you guys what a. All right, you see that, guys? It's rainy morning. You hear the birds? I beat the sun up. Boom, one, done. So we're gonna get Connor McGregor on the podcast. This is what I do for the workout. And I always listen to motivational stuff when I work out. So it started off four o'clock in the morning where I'd start, start with my cardio, then I'd have breakfast, and then I'll go to the gym, and then I'd go to work. Let's do one for the view, because I'm going to have work. I have no idea what 4 a.m. looks like. It's a loop. I'll wake up at 4 a.m. Because you're too busy sleeping in. I'm pretty sure I wake up earlier than all of you. Let me do a talk here. sleep when we're tired, we sleep, sleep when, when we're we are. Done. That's what I did last night. Too busy. All right, normally post on social media slowing me down. This is plain oatmeal, blah, I only eat to survive. Um, we're gonna be taking vitamins with Mel Luca. This is my dad's wallpaper I wanna change, by the way. And then we just wrote down my goals breakfast. Do 50 calls min minimum, power base we're gonna focus on again. Uh, go over handyman, uh, hire uh, for my units, the cash flow. We're gonna interview, interview Alex more in mindset. And then I, I plan out the day, but I leave space so I can fit it in. Do work lunch calls. Leave Manchester 1030 for the Alex interview. Um, and then actually while I'm eating usually, so actually on the other side, I ran out of the 10X um, group thing, so I wrote my goals down here on the back, my five, 77 million, focus on what helps others first, collect money, trust dividend, raise sales weekly, uh, increase targets, always, uh, all the time, I always forget to do that, thank you Dave Robarts. Uh, uh, have number one podcast interview show, which it's looking like it's happening with uh, Lena Cardone and uh, Brian Cuban, Mark Cuban. Uh, I think we're gonna get Connor and maybe my boy Tebow, um, so. And, and th th everybody's like, how do you do that? Also, we, there's two leads on here, and this isn't the call list that I got from automation, which I will, I, I'm gonna teach people eventually what I'm doing for automation, because uh, that's where I do a lot of my uh, work as well. Um, so that's it, I'm gonna finish eating this lovely oatmeal. Yum, Ugh. but it doesn't matter, man. I, I eat to survive, and I don't eat much because I'm actually losing weight, which is good, because if I get too buff, Girls think I'm attractive, and then it gets me off my focus. So I got it all planned out. I've got stuff playing. By the way, I keep a notebook here in case I um, need to write anything down. A life is live. Look, I think I have an I collect 100 shirt there. Um, I jot it down at night. So if I like come with an idea, I jot it down right there. All right, we always have Tom Bilio still going in the background. This is Kurt on you. We're gonna start. We're actually, I took notes from the mentor call, so I'm gonna do what they suggested, not what I'm on. Um, and look at over here. This is a promo that someone's paying me to promote um, on their uh, on my Instagram. The guy's paying me $25, which is under cost. I'm gonna. Grant says monetize everything, so I had him send it to me. So that's that's going on over there because I closed him over the phone last night after the mentor call, and now we're doing this here because we're starting at zero. I have nothing right now. I went down to broke, so I need to make money. That's why I need to do the calls. Uh, I invested all in the software, so you just gotta you gotta hustle again. Um, and look, JC Tanati taught me everything here. So this is one of my mentors. So I, I envision doing calls for him. Right now, we're gonna do it for this. That big and it's full. The wealthiest, most successful companies and people on this planet have pipelines. I always take notes. I take notes. And loaded. Well, I do hey, it's Jeff. Uh, Jeff C of uh, JeffJCunningham.com. I'm a YouTuber, software developer. We met a long time ago, I think, in Miami. Do you I have a lead generation software. Do you remember? It was, I think, at a Chili's. Yeah, Bayside, man, wow, good memory. But anyway, I learned a lot since then. So now, dude, now I have a coaching business. So I coach people how to make money online, $250 an hour people are paying me, which is insane. Isn't that crazy? So now what I've done is that I'm scaling it out to get people who have knowledge, and if they want, 
I can write them leads to coach and do consulting because I'm actually getting overbooked now because of certain things. I'm going to be putting a testimony video. I have a guy building me a whole landing funnel. So with all this quarantine time, I've been pretty productive, you know? Yeah. So what do you, what do, you do again? I forgot my mask. I forgot to mask with the whole line to get in here. I might miss the interview. I feel like we uh, came in here and made it a whole ton of work. I'm gonna get paper towels, so I'll be here tomorrow. I might come up later today to do the interview. So I'm gonna come oh. up and clean up today. Cause I'm, I might start painting today. Oh good, so you just cut yes, it off that. Bad. Yeah. Anybody I'm having a problem with, I, I send them love. Spiritually, I think about them in like around a white light and I send them Send me kind of whatever you do. Cause now I'm getting people who need help with stuff and I provide tools for them. Actually what I was doing, I was coaching people and then accepting the payment after. Uh, which is, was fine, and people were always paying something up to it, but now some people don't show, and then my time's like really valuable, even more so than before. Yeah. So now we're just gonna switch the method, and uh, and that's it, man. And Elena Cardone's friend, Bobby. Uh, Would you give me five minutes to show you how I could do it? I'm asking for a little bit of time for $44,000 to put back into his pocket. That is when he says yes. He can't just tell me he's busy right now because he ain't got leads to call. Yeah. And he can't tell me he's good because he just told me he's missing out on $100,000 a year. He can't tell me he's not interested because I know he's interested in money or else he wouldn't have been at work today. Does that make sense? Yeah, it's good. Thank you, man. I knew I was missing all this part. I knew I was being too pitchy on my calls, and I couldn't figure it out, so thank you. I appreciate it. Okay. You're welcome. Jeff, it's, it's always a pleasure working with you, brother. Always, man. But, so, that's, you got it. That, that's, that's what I was missing. I knew it. I was being too pitchy. So anybody I sold, I'm sorry if I was too pitchy. I was really trying to sell with the heart. But with him, I was too pitchy. I felt like I had to show off a little bit. Because Dave, you know? And I got nervous. Um, but yeah, it's, I think we might put this up here. I'm not, no, maybe we'll call one right now and we'll practice. Because the best way to do it is get right into it. It's venture capitalist, he's very rich. I sell my sunrise and my sunset. We're just gonna go out on the marketplace. I can't wait till my mask is here. When it's here, maybe this whole thing will be over. You know, still got some work to do, so. We're gonna get some stuff automized. Thank you, Dean. See that sunset? It's all about, it's all about what you want in life, you guys. Go get it, man. And every moment, every waking day, I'm going for it. And I'm learning and I'm getting better. Somebody. Yeah, that's what you said, too. Just to end my leg. Yeah. You gotta always, what do you feed your mind? When I was poor, everywhere I went.